This is Twit. So we have an email, and actually this email, Gina, is very applicable to uh, what you got going on right now in the background. Yes, I do. It's true. Uh, okay, so we got an email. Hey, AAA crew. So my Nexus 7, the first first gen, got the update to KitKat this weekend. And I'm a little disappointed. You've mentioned some of the goodness you've been experiencing on your Nexus 5s, but the 7 doesn't seem to have the same goodness, like OK Google from the locker home screen. I still have the widgets tab in the app drawer, and I can't create new home screens by dragging widgets or shortcuts. And am I missing something, or, or, or are Google making the phone and tablet experience completely different? Enjoy the show. Regards, Graham Brown. Graham, I just update, updated my first gen uh, uh, Nexus 7, literally like just before the show started. I love to, it when things work Android. like that. I know, I know. <laughs> and um, and you're right. I also still have the widgets tab mm -hmm. and the dragging. I have the white status bar, which is like the only reason why I knew it was done. Um, so... Yeah, you're right. I actually don't know what the answer to this question is. I don't know why the tablet experience does seem to be slightly different. Um, but you can install the Google Experience Launcher uh, if you're willing to, to, you know, use a little elbow grease. Fandroid actually wrote up a piece on how to install the the gel or the Google Experience Launcher. You actually have to sideload um, a, a couple of files. Uh, it, it comes with the Google Search, the new Google Search update, which you probably have gotten. Right. But you also have to sideload a couple of other files in order to enable it um and i haven't had a chance to try this yet i'm gonna tr i'm gonna try it af after the after the show but but you get so the you'll get some of the extra kit kat goodness well so um, yeah so so what it is exactly from what i understand is basically when you have the new search which everybody probably does already uh the launcher stuff is tied into it already, right? Like we've talked about that on past episodes, but you're not seeing the Google experience, the gel overlay. That's because, and, and I have it on, on the Nexus 5, they have the APK for that particular launcher that they pulled from the Nexus 5 that you can install as an APK. And that basically taps into the, the uh, launcher stuff that's stored in the search app and activates it. So, okay. um, and Google did say when the Nexus 5 came out, that the Nexus 5 was going to be the device that has that that experience right. um, and right. that not all devices would get it. They'd get the update to to KitKat, but they wouldn't necessarily get the Google Experience Launcher. Uh, this is just a way to wake up the Google Experience Launcher. And, we ha and I, I have to imagine anyways that this APK for the launcher eventually is going to hit the Play Store right. at some time right. and Google's going to say, yes, now everybody can, can do this. I'm still hooked on AV8. Personally. Oh, really? Yeah, I love it. It's, oh, interesting. Yeah, it's changed everything. Oh, that's cool. Because I'm like one of these folks that can't organize anything like to save my life. So mm -hmm. if it does it for me, it's great. Okay. <laughs> and see, and I, I installed AV8 and I actually talked about it on the show and I I appreciated the design of it, but it's really hard for me to, to navigate away from the traditional launcher. Yeah, like, it's like a, a partly a because we do this show. Right. I feel like I kind of need to, but yeah. I'm just my brain works so well in that that it's hard for I me mean, to I mean, I've, I've even started using Foursquare again cuz it's always trying to figure out right where there. I am and it's like where are you going and what mm -hmm. you're doing and yeah, I think it's great. So uh, I don't know, Google has to win me over yet. Oh, interesting. <laughs> interesting. Independent developers. <laughs> 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 Definitely biased. Yeah.